All right, it is a beautiful Friday, uh, mid-March afternoon in Western Seoul. There's the motorcycle, we'll do a quick 360. This is uh, the intersection of Busan Station. This is where I train on Fridays. Gorgeous day. And then what you see right here, bam, CrossFit Choi Mountain. Let's go ahead and walk down into the box. Pretty nice uh, decorations. I love the fact that it's downstairs, it's like a dungeon. So that definitely sets the mood for doing some heavy compounds. I'm gonna do deadlift and close grip, close grip bench today. Ready to get it on. The woman right there that said hello to me, she's one of the part owners of this CrossFit program. She's a real nice woman. Back at CrossFit on Friday for my deadlift and close grip bench press workout. What you're seeing right now is three sets of three reps with 400 pounds, which was my AMRAP weight from the week before. The sets and the reps went well. None of them were really that difficult or you know grindy. The, 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 the pace was good, the speed was good. I wasn't nervous or anxious going into this workout. And so after my three sets of three reps with 400 pounds going into my AMRAP set, which I did at 410 pounds, I was feeling good, I was feeling confident, wasn't tired. I ate plenty before my workout, and so uh, the result that I got was a little bit disappointing. Uh, you will see that I did uh, 10 pounds for five reps, and on the fifth rep, which is coming up shortly, you will see that my grip kind of gave out. And what that uh, is a sign of, if your grip feels weak, it's often a, a sign of some nervous system, CNS uh, fatigue, and. I wasn't too shocked about that. Uh, this week, I, there was a lot of volume in, in my squatting. I did five sets of five reps on Monday at 315 pound low bar. On Wednesday, I did uh, four sets of eight high bar and uh, front squat PR set of five. So I think my body or my, my lower body was just a little bit taxed and a little bit cached. You know, I, I was feeling good, but just not uh, at top strength today. But that's okay because. I did nine reps of 400 and uh, six reps of 410. I did a single after this AMRAP set, so that brought my total reps to 15. I think that's a volume PR in my whole life. I've never done that all in one workout. So nonetheless, I was really satisfied. Uh, during this AMRAP set, there was some filming going on, some CrossFit like uh, commercials or informative videos, so maybe the mood just wasn't there. Anyways, uh, what you see right here, this is my uh, every minute on the minute deadlifts, uh, six sets of three at 280 pounds. I really like these because it allows me to really dial in on having perfect form and you know some hy hypertrophy in the you know, deadlifting muscle groups. Uh, during that one minute, I just walk around the CrossFit box just to get some, you know ex some exercise. After that was one arm dumbbell rows. What you're seeing right here is 100 pounds for nine reps. Last last workout, I got eight, so that that was minor progress. But any progress is always something that you want to uh, strive for. After this set of nine with uh, 100 pounds, I went and went ahead and dropped the weight down to 70, and I got 19 reps, I believe, for the first set and 18 for the second set on both arms. So. That's some really nice progress with my dumbbell rows. The previous weeks, I'd only gotten like 15 or maybe 16 reps with this weight. So that's, you know, uh, wonderful. So overall, you know, considering that I was kind of beat up and just tired from all the squatting this week, the workout still went great. Uh, I left the gym you know, tired but not destroyed. So that's all, also always a, a good thing to do. You never want to completely annihilate your body. You want to stimulate your muscles, stimulate growth, but not kill yourself. That's all she wrote for today's deadlift workout. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, please leave a thumbs up and support the channel. If you haven't subscribed, please do so now. Uh, thank you for your support. I will see you guys in the next video.